Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm just going to be doing my makeup of the day. And the only thing that I have on my face right now is just my sunscreen, which is this one. This is the Mary Kay Time Wise. It's a age minimizing 3D day cream SPF of 30. So yeah, this is for the um, combination to oily skin. And I love this. This lasts me like 3-4 months. So for the primer, you guys already know, I'm just going to do the same thing. First, I'm just going to go ahead with the e.l.f. Putty Primer. I'm just going to use a little bit of this for my um, pore area. Like this right here. I'm just going to do a little bit of that. And then on top of that, I'm going to go in with this e.l.f. Jolly Pop Dew Primer. I'm just going to use a two pump like always for my whole face. I really do like this primer. Foundation. I'm going to do a little bit more matte foundation. I'm going to go in with this one. It's the Fin Me Matte and Poreless. And I'm using mine in the color 230 Natural Buff. And this one, you guys already know, does not come with a pump. So I'm just going to pour a little bit. Ah, too much. I'm just going to pour a little bit on the back of my hand. And then with this beauty sponge. It just came in a little box with a bunch of sponges. So, so far, this is the one that I've been using. So this is what the color looks like. I think this uh, this way is a little bit better because the sun is just rising. So today is already the 2nd of June. I don't know when I'm going to be uploading this one. But I don't know what we're going to do. But I just wanted to put on a little bit of makeup. I've been waking up so early now. Like before I used to like go to sleep so late and wake up so late. But now... I've been going to sleep like on time, like at 10, 11, midnight. And I'd be waking up like at 7 o'clock every morning. And I just like can't go back to sleep. So I just like either lay in bed for like a little bit or just get up and like clean and stuff like that. So yeah, I've been, it's been pretty productive. Now I just need to figure out what I'm going to do with all my time. It's kind of weird because when you're like... When you're so used to like taking care of people and stuff like that and then now that you're like on your own again it's so weird so with this i'm gonna set i've just been i've been liking this powder the aoa studio perfect finish press powder i like it because it's not so soft like it's not so soft and crummy where like when you oh can you see sorry i think you guys can see like it's soft but it's not to the point where like it's like crummy off every time you dip your brush into it because a lot of the um powder that i have does that and only like this one and the stay matte one is the only one that is not so crummy and soft like it's not too soft you know like it sets but it's not like super powdery and stuff so with the dew primer it does make it look super healthy there's like a sheen to it I don't know if you guys can tell, but on my lips, I only have Vaseline on because my lip is so crusty and dry this summer. I'm still trying to heal it from last time when it got sunburnt. So yeah, this is my base. I'm just going to go in with this brow pencil, the AOA Studio Slim Brow in the color Medium Brown. I'm just using all like the same product that I always use and this brow is straighter when I do my brow I swear I never talk I'm just remembering that less is more so I you I'm trying to just do like an outline and then just a little bit in the front because less is more okay now this one we already know i try to make it straight 
like more straight than curvy because this one is so arch and you guys already know that's my biggest problem with this brow and this one probably is way thicker because it's stubborn and archy And I have to make this one thicker to match. It just gets crazy. Something like that. Just gonna set it with a little bit of powder. And I'm going to go back in with the Wet n Wild one and just trace over it because this one's a little bit darker and it's um, more soft. Something like that. This is just how I've been doing my brows because my brows are crazy and then you guys already know i feel like this palette is so worth it so if you guys haven't grabbed it you guys should totally get it because it comes with two bronzer two highlighter a powder and then a blush i really like these um butter bronzers so i'm gonna go in with this dark one first to contour My follicles are coming out. I'm going so bald right here, guys. I don't know what it is. And then I'm going to go in with the this other one. And this one's just more for like bronzy because it's a little bit more orange. And for blush, you guys already know, I've been using this one, this old one, called Amaretto. I really like it. The other two is like way too pink for me. Like, I could wear like in the summertime or something, which is really the summertime, but I need to wait until I'm wearing like more colorful looks. I just love the way this blush brings me back to life okay so after this i'm gonna go move on to my eyes um the sun's coming up so the lighting's gonna be changing a little bit i'm just gonna go ahead and use the dominique latte palette i just love this palette too i'm gonna do something super simple like i'm pretty sure you guys already seen me do this just like a million times so it's nothing special I'm just using all the top row right here. I just went in first with this color right here and then I went in with this one. So right now I'm going to go in with this one and then I'm going to finish off with this one. So I'm just using these ones.
So I'm going to go ahead and do my liquid liner first before I put the darkest brown on the outside of my crease just to see exactly where I'm going to put it. You guys already know which liquid liner I'm going to be using. It's no surprise to any of us now that I'm going to be using the Wet n Wild Breakup Proof Waterproof Liquid Liner. I really like it. I think it, I like the uh, consistency and I like the way it uh, like wears. It is waterproof. And this is just more like my simple everyday makeup look. If I am wearing makeup, this is what I'm wearing. And then for mascara, I'm just going to go with the Luminous Lash Paradise by L'Oreal. And we already know how crazy and baby my lashes are. So pretty much this is it for my everyday makeup with the darkest brown in mocha creating a fake crease so this is pretty much it I'm gonna go on with my lips and for the lips I'm gonna go in with Going with this Wet n Wild Color Icon Lip Liner in the color Chestnut. This was like 97 cents at Walmart. I've been really into these like brick brown lip liners lippies just overlining my lip a little bit and then for the lipstick that i'm gonna use is this one the taurus from carly bible i swear this is so freaking pretty and as you guys know i am a taurus and this one's like the more pinky nude And a little bit goes a long way. I love this um, formula of her lipstick because there's nothing like it. It's so soft, so powdery. Like the hint of pink just goes so well with this lip liner. But this combo is really nice. And if you want it to be glossy, then just add on some of the lifter gloss. But I want it to be matte, so I'm just going to keep it like this. But if you guys want it a shinier lip, you guys could try on any lip gloss, actually. But the lifter gloss, it's been pretty good. I've been enjoying those, too. Or the um, ColourPop Luxe lip gloss. Those are pretty good, too. So, yeah. This is my final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it looks similar to some of the other looks that I've done. But this is these are just the tones that I gravitate towards and I wear like on the daily and stuff like that. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. I'm so sorry, you guys. I forgot to set my face in. But you guys already know that I'm going to be using the Lasting Fix by Maybelline. So if you guys can see my mirror in front of me, my bad.
Okay, guys, so this is finally officially my finished finish look. So yeah, on the regular basis, I don't wear lashes like that. And this is it. This is as put together as I'm gonna be on a regular basis. Like this is already like too much makeup. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.